Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to do sequence to sequence model algorithm with SageMaker. It's a form of Google Translate. Here we go, guys. Um, if you guys want to do other other languages, well, here you go. Go to this website, and then I'll show you how to download it if you want to do another language. Or you would put, you would put right here, whatever you want to do. You would replace this or this. Oh, and of course, I have, yeah. Okay, guys. Hold on. Oh, and then you guys got to create two files. This is part of natural language processing. I've got time to do all of this. Okay. okay, and then uh, here's what we do. We get our vocab list and uh, we make our train list and test list. And then we upload them to the bucket. And here where we go to container and image URI. Sequence to sequence. And now we get to the hyperparameters. Experimented with a couple of languages. They didn't have too many options as you can see. I just went with German. I guess. Okay. Okay, we start the training job. And then I got to warn you guys, this will take an hour depending on your uh, data set size also. And you have an, or you have an option. You can use pre-trained model equals true and then do the rest. Upload into the bucket. And then we work on our deployment at this instance. Oh, guys, I got to tell you, back at the other thing, I got to warn you. You guys got to deploy at this instance. It should be compatible with your account. E3 2x large. If you deploy at any of the larger instances, you may need to call AWS for permission to upgrade and deploy it M1, M4, X large, of course. And then here's where we go to the prediction since the endpoint's been created and the runtime is SageMaker. Okay, I honestly don't know any German, but. Oh. Huh. Um, there we have it. This is your basic form of natural language processing. Okay, now if you guys want to do anything else, these are your options. Remember this website, stamp.org, WMT. And I showed you guys from the beginning, right, how to download it. As you can see, I downloaded another data set, actually. 
and it was taking forever, so I went with German. Okay, guys, there you have it. Next time we're going to deploy an XG boost model, but regression instead of classification. Thank you.